Hey y'all, welcome to WinDev. Uh, today we're gonna be doing something a little different. It's gonna be how to set up your React, okay? With Tailwind, okay? Or, or any. So what you would do is, let's close this up. Sorry about that. Okay. What you would do is you go to uh, MP, MPX, create React app, right? We're gonna go here. We're gonna copy this line here, okay? And then just choose. Uh, what I would do to be easier is just open up this. VS Code. Okay, and then for Mac is Command J. For for Windows or Control J. Okay, and then just paste that line and whatever you want to call here. Just say my first React. Okay, and just hit enter and let it run for a second. Okay, now we got it. We're gonna CD into the folder we made for my first React. We got into it. And what do we want to do with it? And let's go down here. Go top just to open it, right? Now we got that open. Let's go ahead and look into our source. Okay, we have all these folders. Okay, so we're not gonna take away anything. But let's go with npm start. We're gonna bring up our browser. There we go. We got everything there. If you look in the code, this is what pops up, okay? Now, a lot of people are asking, how do I connect to Tailwind, okay? If you look at Tailwind, but if you just look at like uh, React Tailwind, just search it up like that, it would have given you the the steps that we took. Okay, but these are the steps. Just copy that. Uh, bring up another terminal. Hit enter on that, and we're gonna copy another one here. It's gonna create our config file, okay? Our config file, and we're gonna change our config file to this, right? And go ahead and overwrite those. Take care of that. Done. And the second step, the third step, is just to copy that and go to our index CSS. Just replace all of these. Okay, and then let's go down here and just let's just stop our terminal for a little bit since we changed our config file. We're running again. Okay, now we have that opened. What do we want to do? Let's see. Now we got to test. If, if it's working properly, okay. Ain't able to do that, just go here and we're gonna go on this line here, the P tag, change the class name and let's do text red 500. There we go. Now we know it works. Now you're good to go with Tailwind and your React is created. You are good to go. Thank you, y'all.
see you next time if you like these kind of short uh, helpful tips you know, comment down below and let's make more of these okay